Hi guys, it's Vicky. Well, we're gonna try this again. Let's see if this works. I checked it this morning, I made a fake video, and it worked. So let's see if it'll work when I make a real video. Okay, so today I'm going to do Roxy's weekly challenge, but her last week challenge, uh, week 34, you know, doing the master board with the doily collage tags and journal cards. Okay, let's make some room here. All right. Okay. Um, she, uh, you know, they use some digital lace picks. Well, right now, I have to, like, slow down on buying things. We had so much crap going on with our cars. First I broke, well I didn't, but a rock flew into my window, cracked it, so I had to get that fixed. Then, going home from grocery shopping a few days ago, my radiator hose or coolant hose, that broke off. <sighs> so, you know, we just have to, I have to lay off on buying stuff. So, what I did was, I actually photocopied lace that used to be my husband's great-grandmother's stuff that she had done you know a billion years ago so I just photocopied them they don't look as nice as the digitals but for now this is what I gotta do I do like this one I think this is this pretty it's not as bright because my copier is not photo ready so or photo sufficient. I don't know the word I'm supposed to be using. And then I also just slightly fussy cut, not really fussy, just around some of the smaller pieces, like one of the bigger lace ones. I figure it's not going to matter. And the funny thing was, I just got done fussy cutting some stuff while I was watching Rachel's video for this week. Okay. So, I just noticed done that one and it didn't glue all the way okay so I I did most of the the master boarding <laughs> that's the word I can use um, off camera um, hers was really long you know my table's teeny tiny my camera you know hoping it works so I just I did it a small one it's, it's full two pages and then I, I glued some uh, other little scraps I had. This one right here. Oh, that's that's nothing. Uh, this one, these two, were from um, my paper that I used just to stamp. And then, you know, you get that little extra overboard. I just decided to use that. So, And then I also had spritzed um, some of my Glimmer Mist on here. I had made a label and I glitzed it, but now I can't find that label. So, oh well, life goes on, right? Okay, so let's get started. All right. This was one of the ones that I just messy cut. I'm gonna try and do that rip that I see y'all do with your rulers. I don't really have a very strong one. I got these plastic ones that I got. This one's from Creative Memories. Okay. I wanna see if I got you guys on frame. Yes. All right. Okay, let's glue. Grab my, um, is this my glue one? I really gotta start throwing stuff out. <laughs> I don't know if this is my glue one or my, um, I had moved my camera to show you my mess, but you guys know I have issues with my camera. So I'm just gonna rip out another page. 
Oh, I really didn't want to do that. I'll just use this. Okay. Got parts of me is thinking, do I really want to use the glue stick on all this? Should I just use my um, um, sticker roll tape? Okay. So I'm going to stick this right here. Okay. Then I'm going to do another corner one. You can't see it, but she had like embossed it with the white thread. But you can't see it because my photocopy is not all that great. So parts of me is thinking, should I use it? Should I just stick with going straight? Yeah, that's what I'm going to do. I'm just going to stick with going straight. Ah! Oh well. I got my dog over here looking at me. She's like, um, Mom, you're making some noise over here. stick this one I don't want to I don't know if I want to hide the some of the pages I also had glued on okay I'm gonna glue some of the ones I just kind of roughly cut out I mean you're not gonna really see that I like just went around like that because you're gonna be cutting this. Okay, I have one more of those little ones. Here it is. Teeny tiny. Right here. You know, 10 to 15 years ago, I heard people calling this, what I'm doing right now, kinda like collaging. They used to call it, I'm gonna put it right on top of that one. <laughs> Um, why they called it? What's that word? Serendipity squares. First time I heard that word was on the Carol Duvall show. Um, I think I'll go with this. see this one. I think I like this one more. Oh, that's right. It's another corner one I'm going to do then. Okay. I'm going to do a little cut wrap. Since I'm going to do it right against the edge, maybe I'll make the lace pattern look kind of cool. But since I'm not getting a good grip on it sometimes, who knows? it's because it's just plastic and it's like kind of a flimsy pla plastic you know see right here that uh it doesn't rip very nice This is why you have to clean your 
table. <laughs> you need to have more room if you clean your table, Vicky. Okay, and then God, there's a, you know I really like that one I showed you that was purple. I want to save that. I don't know why. And I don't know for what. Okay, then I guess I'll go back to doing this one that I was thinking about doing earlier. It's almost lunchtime. And I am starving my Marvin. I had breakfast. I guess a bowl of cereal doesn't really tide you, huh? I have an issue. Issue. Well. That's so bad. Yeah, I think it's because it's kind of flimsy. Okay. That's okay. Handkerchiefs were probably, gosh, I think they were 80 years old. I'm just gonna rip right here. The weather is starting to get nicer here and where I live in northern Indiana. I still have the air on because the dew points are feeling still a little icky for me. They're supposed to go down after lunch, so I figure I'll just wait. Since I'm still not feeling good, which you guys probably don't remember or, you know, because that video flaked out on me, um, I got an ear blockage. And I think it's messing with my head. No, not my brain, my head. <laughs> okay, and then I think I want to do... Um, I think I have a green one. I know I have a green one. Yeah, here it is. It's not like spectacularly dark green, but it'll do for me. Oh, I should have like messy fussy cut that. But, eh. It's okay. Yeah, it's not so bad. Actually, I think I'm gonna go down this way. Oh, <laughs> Snaggy on me again. Oh, there we go. I just... <laughs> Okay, and then on the other side. And then it's a little, so I'm gonna, there. All right. There we go. 
and then I'm going to put this one down this way. Uh-oh, my dog's going to start barking at me. Okay. Then what I'm going to do... Oh, you know what? Parts of me wants to do it with the pink. My pink distressed ink. I'm going to... And I'm going to just kind of go over it. Uh, I don't know, guys. I'm not seeing anything. I don't know. Maybe I need to stick with the... Why isn't that working? Oh, there's stuff in there. Maybe it's too light. Yeah, I can kind of see it, but you have to get close up. <laughs> oh, I should probably do this over. Not very big, but at least it'll let me do this. Oh, I didn't tape that or You know, when you put the glue down and everything, and then you notice, oh, you missed a spot. Oh, you missed a spot. <laughs> That's what I'm experiencing right now. Oh, I missed a spot. <laughs> Jeez. <laughs> I'm not sure if I did this part. Okay, well, unless you're up close, you really can't see it. I don't know if you guys can see it. Oh, well. Okay. Then, oh, I'm getting, seeing if there's anything I need to cut off. A little bit. Well, not really. I mean, would it be so bad if I kept it? Okay. So, let's glue, put the cap on the glue. Alright. Then, this is where you make your, your your cards and your tags. So this is, I'm gonna make it. And then, you know, I'm also gonna do some, just some squares. around them. Oh, there we go. I'm going to make some three inch. Then I'm going to make another three inch. And I'm going to keep that one. I'm going to keep that one the size. 
And then I'm going to cut this one in half. I'll go the other side where there's more of a straight edge. Okay. And then That's okay. I'll cut that right now. Thank you. Then maybe some thin tags. Some small tags. Okay. Oh, this one. I don't know. Parts of me is thinking, do I want to keep it this length? No. I think I'm gonna. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna make a square and then the tag. There we go. Okay. Then I believed um, this is where she started doing her little her decorating part of the show. That's right. Roxy Creations is a show. <laughs> okay, where's my fussy cut stuff? Here they are. Okay. Um, this one's a long one. I'm going to make this one a tag. here cut that oh that did not look pretty no indeed that does not look pretty that's okay no it's still gonna be off See, I'm doing this wrong, I think. I'm watching people do it. They just take the one side. Then they go to the other side. And they have no problems doing it. I do that, and it looks like, you know, I'm the queen of lopsidedness. Not the prettiest tag. That's not so bad. Okay. And then I think I'm gonna oh making a mess here. Okay. Then glue this on. I'm trying to be careful. See, I fussy cussed it, cussed it. <laughs> I fussy cut it so much. I got teeny weeny pieces all over the place. Okay. Put that. There. Oh, where's my smusher? That's okay. I'll just use my hand. There's that one. I went a little bit too far. Okay. All right. Okay. Let's 
try this again. Then I think you flick it to the other side. from the vellum. Oh, I want to make sure I'm gluing the right side. Okay. I want to put this one right here. Okay. Oh, I like I don't know. This one, I wish I had my, oh, you know what? I do have a corner punch. It's not a true corner punch. It's the one that has like a design on it. My stuff is still packed from when we moved here. So a lot of my stuff is still in boxes. Yeah, that didn't work out so well. I'm wondering if it's because it's so thick, the punch can't do it. Well, it's too much stuff on it, I guess, for the collaging. That's okay. You know what? I'll put a label there. Labels that I made. Oops. I should have been doing this on my paper. Just stick it right there and hide it. And then I'll glue this just kind of go around. You know, that's what I'm going to do in the next few days. I am going to This one. This is gonna be just a, a journal card. And I'm gonna put the um, butterflies. Make sure I am glue on the right side. Because they're vellum. I think it was this side. But you know, you know one side when it's a printed vellum is slightly. I just ripped my butterfly. Oh well. Life goes on, even in butterfly land. And then just do the antlers, because the antlers are showing. And the bottom part. <laughs> there. Oh, the broken wing. I did not glue all the way. Probably because when I ripped it. All right. And I'll keep this straight. And then I have one more. I like that. One of my squares. Put right 
still put some uh, labels on. So that is what I'm going to do. This one's gotten a little teeny tiny though. So I won't do that. The one that I did that. Okay. My little homemade um, labels that I make because I don't have stamp ones yet. Okay, then I have this one. I'll put that one right above there. label on that one. <laughs> Remember because I messed it up. But this one is going to be too big. So eh, doesn't really need a label. <laughs> okay. Then I'm going to ink them up but I want to stay away from the pink one. And I'm going to do my reliable walnut stain. And just ink around them. up, you know, near the top. I kind of like it that the one side's a little roughed up. Square. I like using the squares too because, you know, oh, can journal. I mean, I guess you can. You just got to put a paper on the back of it. But sometimes I use the squares also just for decorating. Some of the ones that are taggish, uh, you know, poking a hole and um, putting on a little tassel. But here we go. Got this one, another tag, a journal card, a square, and a big long journal card. And then I also had all these other extras that you can decide, you know, when you make your own, what to do with them. You can make them small, I can make them smaller, make them like the tags again. So I still have all these two that I can work with. Well, thanks a lot, Rachel, for another great challenge. I'm a week late, but you know, that's okay. Okay, guys, I'll see you later. Bye-bye.